Hi everyone, The Simple Dad here. In this video, I'll show you how to record a touch macro for one press action on your Samsung Galaxy device. So with touch macro, you can record a sequence of taps or swipes and then run it anytime with just one press. So for example, maybe opening settings, turning on a hotspot. So enabling Bluetooth can all be done instantly. So let me show you how to do this on your Samsung Galaxy device. So here is an example. We'll go ahead and post something on Instagram. So here we'll go ahead and open up the GoodLock app first. Now on the GoodLock app, you wanna go ahead and find the Routine Plus app. Now in the Routine Plus app, you wanna go ahead and find Run a Touch Macro. So you can start a routine to trigger a series of touch actions. Tap on this. So here we can go ahead and make it start manually, or we can go ahead and set up our touch macro, and then we can go ahead and run a routine to run that touch macro at a certain time. So let's first go ahead and create a touch macro. So here we'll go ahead and then tap on touch macro. So here's an example, let's go ahead and add a new one. So we wanna go ahead and post something to Instagram. So we can go ahead and just tap on find Instagram. Now here we'll go ahead and press record. So now to post something on Instagram, we'll go ahead and tap on the plus sign. Then we'll go ahead and tap on a picture. Now we're gonna go ahead and post it to your story. And then press home. And there you go. Let's just press stop now and then save that. So now we can go ahead and give this a name, Instagram post. Now we can press save. And now that touch macro has been saved. So to play it, we can go ahead and try it out. And there you go. So that's been played. So now once you're happy, press done and then press save again. And now that touch macro has been saved. So now to run this at a particular time, you can go ahead and tap on routine, tap on the plus sign. You can set the if and then, so if the time, so I'm gonna run it daily. So I can set a time daily, press done, and then I can go ahead and set it to run that particular macro. So I'll go ahead and search for macro, touch macro, find the Instagram post, tap done, and then save it, give it a name, and then press done. So now at a particular time, that macro will run and will basically post an Instagram story daily. So it's a huge time saver for a repetitive task, turning multiple steps into a single effortless action. So there you go, guys. That is how to record a touch macro for one press action on your Samsung Galaxy device. If you're new on the channel and you want to find out more about your iPhone, your Android phone, or any other social media apps, then don't forget to subscribe to this channel to become a part of the Simple Dad community. Hit the like button if you find this video useful.